हेलो व्यूअर्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल अगेन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट अ वेरी गुड एंड वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक कॉल्ड एज रेसिपी कॉन्फ़िगरेशन सो टू टू स्टार्ट विथ वी नीड पी टी आई पोर्टल सॉफ्टवेयर एंड आई हैव ऑलरेडी एडेड पी एल सी पी एल सी एंड एच एम आई इन माई प्रोजेक्ट टू रिड्यूस द वीडियो टाइमिंग सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट डज मीन रेसिपी रेसिपी मीन्स लेट्स से वी आर गोइंग टू मेक ए केक सो to make a cake what what are the ingredients you have to you know, add it chocolate milk cocoa powder sugar this kind of uh, things you need to add it right so in industry if you want to make a cake uh, let's say it is a chocolate cake then your cocoa powders will be uh, more chocolate will be more strawberry will be less sugar will be less likewise it is happening same for a uh, strawberry cake or uh, for a regular cake what is happening sugar will be more cake, chocolate cake will be more uh, chocolate will be less likewise the ingredients will be fluctuate right so for every recipe we can't create uh, more tax for the uh, project right so what we need to do uh, let's make a cake so for a cake what we need first we need milk so this is basically integer data type i am taking because the milk is in percentage everything we are going to take it into percentage value so milk cocoa powder sugar chocolate strawberry and water so i am taking here now total 1 2 3 4 5 6 gradients your recipe could have uh, more uh, more in, uh, ingredients that's uh, totally up to you so we have already added the hmi db and here i have taken milk cocoa powder sugar chocolate strawberry and water so you, uh, while we will simulate you can see, uh, you will see how the percentage of the milk and chocolate cocoa powder and everything of the ingredients will be automatically change as per your recipe so to do so in uh, go to the hmi project and in hmi project i am um, need to close all the windows so in hmi project you can see there is a options called recipe on recipe just double click on it so here you can see it is asking for the recipes what are the recipes you wanted no, wanted because in a single project you could have uh, more than 10 to 15 recipe also but now we are going to take only one recipe so let's give the recipe name called as cake okay and this is the name and this is the display name means on display what uh, what is the name need to be display i am also putting the name called as cake okay and recipe number is 1 version path everything is mentioned here by click on cake what are the elements first it will be sugar uh, let's say milk likewise we have created in db let's split it what are the ingredients we are having milk second is cocoa powder third is chocolate strawberry milk cocoa powder sorry sugar chocolate strawberry and water so same i will give the name to the recipe uh, display name also because in display also i want same kind of things so same now the most important is tag what kind of tag you are going to connect it need not to be same as per your db i am just to making it clear i am making as it is in the db so for milk what is the tag you need to uh, choose here in program blocks main you can see milk is there so select it same cocoa powder let's do for all so i have done with my tagging right now 
so you can see the data type will automatic detect as uh, while the time of linking the tag to it so the data length is 2 because integer is having 2 bytes and currently the default value is 0000, zero, zero, zero. so i am going to put some default value like i want to uh, in cake i want water is 20 percent cocoa powder let's say 30 percent sugar 30 percent so totally 20 30 50 30 80 now chocolate let's say 10 strawberry 5 and water 20 i don't think i am a good baker because i have <laughs> added water 20 percent so it is totally 20 30 60 likewise the values are there uh, these are uh, again remember that these are only values for the examples so now you have added the all element of an recipe but the data records what does mean the data records data records means a cake can be of 500 varieties likewise i have uh, showed you 500 of varieties so you are having a baking company and you want to make seven to eight type of cake flavors like let's say first of all i will give the give the name chocolate cake okay let's say pineapple cake sorry strawberry cake okay likewise you can add it so currently i am taking two kind of cake so the name also again same now you can see in chocolate cake what are the per percentage uh, right now chocolate is having 20 percent of milk cocoa powder is having 30 percent sugar chocolate in chocolate cake chocolate may be uh, maximum like 50 percent or 20 percent let's say 30 percent cocoa powder can be less let's say 20 sugar or sorry cocoa powder will be remain same okay let's say sugar is only having 20 percent because chocolate cake is having already sweet strawberry we don't need strawberry at chocolate cake so zero and water is 20 percent okay same for strawberry what is happening let's say 20 cocoa powder 30 sugar is 30 chocolate zero and strawberry let's say 20 percent and water as it is so the, basically these are all the start values this can be changed by hmi while you will display so we have done with our data records and all so i will take a screen and at screen if i will close the split view in toolbox you can uh, in right side you can see there is a option called recipe okay recipe view this recipe view you need to drag and drop into your picture and in picture just let's set up quickly okay so in property right click on the recipe and go to the property window in general select the recipe by click on the menu you can choose your recipe number or re uh, recipe directly cake is there data records you can give the tag but i don't want to give the record uh, right now so let it be so i have choose the uh, recipe now let's get simulate So both HMI and PLC is being simulated in our projects. So let's go to the DB. And in monitor. So let me introduce what are the contents is helping the uh, having the recipe views. So currently as we don't have the record, uh, we didn't choose any record name. So you can see milk, zero, chocolate, cocoa powder, all kinds of things are getting zero right now. And these are showing the startup values, like some initial values we have already 
put in by default so these are showing so let's say we are going to select chocolate cake so in chocolate uh, by clicking on chocolate cake you can see the milk is 20 cocoa powder is 30 if you want to increase your milk uh, milk percentage then you can also create like 30 percent of milk that would be fine 30 is already in here now you need to save here so this button is called as save by clicking it it will ask you that it will overwrite your data record so yes so the now this is save cocoa powder is 30 20 etc and this is the delete button if you want to delete some of uh, if you are having some of the recipes and you want to delete it then you can delete it and this is for the new one if you want to crea create create uh, some information like rename it you want to change your recipe then you can change here also and this is for the new recipe let's say i want vanilla plus chocolate vanilla chocolate i want both of the recipe then also you can create it okay vanilla chocolate it will take vanilla chocolate right now and in vanilla chocolate what i want to do milk need to be 10 percent only i don't want enough milk in my cake so milk let's say 10 percent cocoa powder i want it 30 percent let it be sugar i want to increase the sugar level chocolate 10 strawberry also 5 both i want it in my vanilla plus chocolate so let's save it so currently we are only playing with the recipes we till now we didn't download into our project so let's say i want to start the production of chocolate cake so i have selected the chocolate chocolate cake and this is called as the load button just click on it you can see the milk is having 30 percent cocoa powder is having 30 percent all of the content of the recipe is being executed into your data block directly so you need not to be uh, 30 to 40 tags for the recipes so only 5 to 6 tags but it will be overwritten let's say instead of now I, our chocolate production is completed now i want to change to strawberry you can see uh, you will see the changes here just focus here i will load it so lo i have loaded it earlier the milk was 30 now it is 20 30 0 20 20 let's say i want to use vanilla for vanilla again it's changed and for vanilla choc and chocolate i want to download it so you can see we have reduced the milk percentage earlier so these are the things so basically this is the recipe video which is very helpful to you and these are the up down properties are there so you can uh, i have explained all of that content of the recipe tag tables you can change the font name colors etc etc as per your choice also i want to uh, add one more thing if you want to uh, know how i can uh, do this sliding screens so i have already mentioned a video about it how to do the sliding screen like this so you can check out my channel uh, so that you can get this kind of screens here so thanks for the cooperation and thank you for keeping in touch with my channel so please like share comment and subscribe to my channel if you like it thank you